Okay, we should be good to go. Let's, um, knock off the music. And kick on the actual game sound. God almighty Christ, it's loud. Yeah. <clears throat> How's it going, guys? This is Salty Combat, and yeah... I know I said I'd do FNAF, but I kind of lost interest. I'll be honest, it was too hard for me. Um, but we're still doing horror games for the spooky season. Uh, it's September. And I don't know why, but September specifically, I feel like doing a classic. I feel like doing Slender the Arrival. I think I used to have a video up on my channel back for those of you who knew me as Ice the Hedgehog 7. I haven't forgotten. But look at the shit we got now. We got lights. We got a computer to stream this shit off of. That's hardwired in. We got a mic. We got headphones. Where the fuck is my control? There it is. got a capture card. We got a fan. Yes, that's what that annoying ass noise is in the uh, background. Gotta say cool though. It's still hot. Also, perfect time to stream this game because I think we are getting either another game or a remake of this. But, uh, as Gordon Ramsay says, enough waffling, let's get into it. Oh my god, chat, yeah. it's, it's my wife, it's, it's my girl, it's my daddy. We're gonna start a new game. Well, what's the promise hunting ground at Oakside Park prides itself? as a charming recreational area for families. Okay, this is going to be hard to fucking read. I've been booped yet. So often we are guided by our direction, our devotion, our love, our affection. A bond that pulls us down paths, not bargains. When you find yourself alone, and he casts out that bede bedeviling gaze, how far will it carry you? I don't know. Uh, hopefully, carry my ass to um. Hold L two to run. Great fucking start. Carry my ass to the fucking. dollar store. I want some Gatorade, bitch. Zoom. Okay. What are you thinking, hon? Do you, do you think we're going with the camera or the POV? No, oh, fuck it. It's a classic, so we're going with the camera. Now, we're not going to try and get any extra shit. We're just going to, you know, try and beat it. Copyright strike. Now we're going... Well, technically, it is a POV. It's just a camera filter.
be it. For me personally, uh, spooky season. Is that my shadow? Damn, I'm skinny. For me personally, spooky season started in August. In August. Uh, for most, it starts in September. And then there's some people who's like, Oh, October. But only October. But let's be real. For those of us who truly love Halloween, every day is spooky season, goddammit. dark in here. I need to find a flashlight. I mean, a flashlight. I mean, I mean, a flashlight. I mean... Honoring the life of Beth Hayes. October 8th, 2009, 9am. Grace Hill Cemetery. 615... 15? What the fuck? 615 Everson Street, Pastor John Taylor. We'll go for like an hour and a half. What? The phone appears to be dead. Well, it wasn't a second ago. Jeez. Ugh. Looks like my sink. Can I have some microwave chimichangas, please? Yeah, it's the fucking song that was playing when I was walking through the woods. Yo, Cubanos! Hell yeah! Don't smoke, kids. One appears to be dead. Thank you. I can't thank you enough for coming out all this way to help me out. It's been a pretty rough road trying to sell this old place. I wish I'd turned to you sooner. You have no idea how happy I'll be once this is all behind me. Love you always, Kate. Say that's Beth and Kate. Tea time! Tea time for tea! <gasps> Signs of a struggle. Also, like... This kind of pisses me off. Oh? I don't know if that has any significance or not. Hey Kate, it's been a while since we last spoke, hasn't it? Hope you haven't forgotten about me. I know writing a letter seems a little old-fashioned, but sometimes I like to just sit down and write something out, you know? So, I can't remember what I was doing at the time, but all this stuff we used to do 
one of our kids just came rushing back to me all of a sudden the other day. Remember when I'd sneak out at night so we could both go on our adventures? Ghost hunting, we called it. We shine the flashlight through the trees and jump at every little insignificant noise. Our imaginations were always working in overdrive. I wish I could rewind to back then. Seems like everything after that just hasn't been as good for both of us. How long has it been again? It's been at least a couple of years, hasn't it? She was always kind of mean to me. Maybe she actually knew about us sneaking out all the time. Guess we'll never... Sorry I ignore all of that. I started rambling too much. Anyway, please let me hear from you soon. I know things have been less than normal for you lately, so I just wanted to check in CR. Okay, good, I closed that. Yes, I am... Ick! Excuse me! Flashlight, batteries, extra tape, lighter, kerosene, lock the house. Okay. Oh, fucking K. Also, yeah, we... I don't think you can ever go out that door. Like, at all in the game. Yes, flying Dorito. Those shotgun shells? That stuff laying on the floor. Plant, they forgot to feed you. Thanks for calling last night. It probably sounds dumb, but it was good to hear your voice again. Good to hear that Lauren's doing been doing really well too, but yeah. About what, uh, what all we said, I'm not sure what to think of it yet. What are the odds of two people having the exact same hallucination? Could it really just be a coincidence? I have to go to my doctor today for some routine stuff, so I'm going to try and casually bring this up, see what he says about it. I'll let you know how it goes, CR. <laughs> I hope that's not copyrighted. I mean, not like I make money off this shit anyways, but... <laughs> and even, like, if somebody wanted to set donations up, I think I had them set up the wrong way. Slandy, man! Mm, not much in the pooper room. And we have entered the gamer zone. What? No. I think it's just a computer with a monitor. 
Is that just like a texture thing, or is there some kind of... We'll call it a dead rat. Sometimes they can be seen there. That's all, uh, lovely. Can you see it? Do you see what I see? To the woods. when you start seeing shit. I can't remember. God, like, little sounds are starting to scare me now. I still can't go through that door. God, my phone. I'm busy, damn it. Oh yeah, and there is an Easter egg just a little bit. Yeah, you see that poster? Yeah, you need to get you need to hit the radio, you need to get the flashlight. Then you click that poster. I'm not going to do it this time cuz it's going to like initiate some bullshit that I don't really want to deal with. Also, what kind of fucking sprint is that? <laughs> Hopefully it's taken care of in the new game. Yeah, you can't even... Can't even get it, like... Uh, b b b excuse me! Hey Kate, both my computer and phone have been acting weird lately, so I figured I'd do it the old-fashioned way again. Glad we can meet up and talk things through. I agree with what the doctor said, too. There is an explanation for this stuff. The shared traumatic sound... The shared traumatic event sounds the most logical to me. The night we were out there in the woods was probably what caused it. I had almost completely blocked that out, but now it's kind of coming back to me. But like I said before, it's still really foggy. I think the best course of action right now is to just ignore it whenever you think you might be seeing things again. I'll try to do the same. That'll probably do the trick. CRPS, you should call Lauren sometime. I bet some company would help. Yes, slide. Now nah, we're gonna go the, the right way. Like, I love exploring and shit, but... Here for a fun time, not a long time, you know? Let's 
Let's see. Fatal Blaze erupts at Oakside Home. Arson suspected. Oakside fire crews say that a blaze at a southeast home resulting in one death may be the result of arson. Fire broke out at the home located just out... Just... Bitch, I was still looking at that. Fucking Slendy Man getting impatient. I like to read, okay? And not like these dumb fucking teenagers that say, Oh please, Daddy Slendy, fiddle my nutsack with your tentacles. It's at this point we can start seeing them. I guess not. I did not know there was a poster there. Maybe there really are three posters that you can find to trigger it. I just never found the third one and I don't think I ever noticed the second one. Either that or the game's trying to pull some bullshit on me. Let's go into the creepy ass house. Is he? What's wrong with this place? Why did this happen to us? What? Let me read! Ooh, hi, buddy. He usually spawns in the same place every fucking time. He usually spawns right there. A uh, small little uh, theory. The game is becoming self-aware and it's fucking with me. Like, I know this shit stemmed from Creepypasta, like, that's Slenderman's whole fucking origin. But... This is literally some Creepypasta type stuff, like... Yeah, the game's not supposed to be doing this. Like, first of all, Slendy Man starts popping up. I'm not allowed to read shit. And Charlie Matheson Jr. over there fucking... Pops up in a different spot.
Usually you're supposed to see Big Daddy Slendy up there in the mountains watching you at this part of the game, but I... I ain't seen him yet. Oh, did I patch something? Like, you're supposed to be able to take a whole sign with you. Find me, Lauren. He came for me. Why didn't I listen? He was right. He said this would happen. Help me. Need CR. He knows how to end this. Come find me. Don't let him in. And now the fun part. By fun, I mean I'm going to piss myself. Reports say... Reports of missing surveyors and prospectors rapidly escalated. Why does this game not want me to reach it? Also, yeah, that door is locked now. And uh, sometimes you'll hear really weird shit. Ah, uh, this is where you can take the whole ass sign. Oakside Park has three canoes available. For them. And there's the weird ass noises. Oak Park canoeing rules. One, personal flotation devices must be worn at all times while in the water. Two, do not cross the line floats into designated swimming areas. Three, reflective gear should be worn if canoeing at night. Four, do not interact with any and all marine life. PDFs are available at the rental shack. Zorbing? What the fuck is Zorbing? Seven. I fucking hate this. Don't look where it takes you. Hey. Fucker. Can't run. Ooh. 
the minute sack. Nope. That's a That's a nope. Kindly. Kindly doodly ho there, neighborino. Slenderino. This is where shit starts to get real. Why is this gonna fuck me? This will fuck me. We got half of the pages. If you think this is bad, this is just based off of, like, the original indie game. Well, this isn't an indie game, too, but, like... Eh, you know what I mean. Back when it was just Slender the Eight Pages. when PewDiePie screamed like a little bitch and uh, Gangnam Style was the hit song. And Slendy Man used to look like One of those sock monkeys without a face. I think I insulted him. Chicken and gravy and taters. Mm. Their bowls are really good. However, if it's like just their chicken, bro, I cannot eat that shit. I'll take like a couple of bites. And then I'm like, oh, I don't like this. Same thing with like Mountain Dew. I'm like, oh, I can tell this isn't good for me. It's not even, like, the fact that it's, like, overly fatty or greasy or what could be that. I don't know. Six of eight. I hate that once you get to this area, you gotta search every fucking room. Nope. I'm gonna 
gladly dip. Like, there's some stuff, like, you know it's bad for you, you can taste that it's bad for you, but you like it, like, um, like Monster Energy, not sponsored. No. Re what? Anyways, like KFC and regular flavored Mountain Dew. I just can't stand it. It's fucking... Not gross, but I'll take like one bite or one sip and I'm like, ugh. Get it away. I don't want it. I don't think that you absolutely 100% need to get all eight pages. But, you know, if you do, it gets the level done quicker. Bitch. Some people say, like, they really don't like KFC mac and cheese. But I honestly really, really like it. Fuck it, I'm going back in the building. He does not want me there. So there's probably something still in here. Okay, there's nothing there. Uh, Christ. He wants my butthole. He wants my sweet, juicy derriere. Well, if he's gonna snatch it, can he snatch it faster? Off. Fuck, I'm just gonna drop. Luckily, you don't take fall damage. Fuck. Mm. 
Hello, my honey. Hello, my baby. Hello, my ragtum gal. These lumps. I know you want to slump up on these lumps. Got him. And now the shitstorm is going to start. Yep. Fuck. So, like, you're scripted to lose. But if you get caught while you're collecting the pages, especially early on, it'll say, I like to cut G. And you gotta start all over again. Come on. Get your ass up. I'm gonna guess that I fell. What the fuck? And my camera batteries are already at like halfway. Okay. I tried to find my way back when I T when I tripped and fell down the slope. But my flashlight hit one of the rocks down there and broke. It was pitch black. I heard sounds all around me, screaming. It sounded like you. I tried to follow it back, but I was lost. I fell. Everything collapsed down around me. I could feel it crushing me. Everything was moving so fast. I was drowning in water I couldn't see. Every fear I've ever had came back to me at once. Monsters surrounded me. My stomach inverted. My eyes shriveled out of existence and my heart caved in. I don't know what happened after that. I woke up in some tall grass today and found my way back to the house. I looked through the window and saw you sitting on the couch staring at your TV. I couldn't get your attention so I left. I can't write anymore. I can't think straight. I need to... I need a what? Attention all employees! After closing this Sunday, your paychecks will be mailed to your home addresses that we have on file for you. Please see Jessica in the office if you have changed your address recently. Otherwise, you will not be able to receive your final paycheck. We would like to thank all of you for your many years of dedicated service to Coleman Mining and wish you the best of luck in all of your future endeavors, management. An abandoned mine shaft. That's all boarded up. <sighs> Fuck it. I'm gonna kill two birds, one stone. That and this is the second scariest part in the game. Are the voices gonna... Give me any sweet lullaby melodies. I didn't even click on that. Warning, Coleman Mining. In the event of sudden power loss, all employees must be removed from the mines via emergency lift as soon as possible. To power the lifts, please activate the emergency generators through the 
throughout the ground level of the complex. Six generators are the minimum required power to are the minimum required to power the lift at full capacity. Please see your supervisor if you need help locating them. Local Park sells land to Coleman Mining Co. Oakland Park, or Oakside Park, has come to an agreement with Coleman Mining Company regarding its acquisition of mineral rights for the state-owned Parks Mountains. President of Coleman Mining, James Walter, said he's glad the deal has gone through and that he couldn't be happier for the opportunities of this new location to provide the company in the community. Oakside Park first entered negotiations with Coleman Mining almost two years prior to the acquisition of Ocean View something. All right. get to the tower. Let's start off here. Yeah, down here is when you first meet the proxy, Kate the Chaser. I'm going to stay away from that. At least for right now. take like two or three hits from her. God, if she is up here, I am fucked. Oh yeah, also it's not just Kate that you gotta worry about here. I believe you also have to worry about Slender. Speak of a fucking bastard. I 
hate this. I fucking hate this. Hi, buddy. So it's a bit of a listening game. Also, I think it's bullshit that, and don't quote me on this, but I think the generators spawn at random. I'm trying to think about this logically, like, the possibility, like, if you run, Kate might hear you. Oh yeah, the same Kate that they were talking about at the beginning of the game. That's her. And I think the no, no, no areas really are like places that you should fuck away from. Okay, two more. I think that's why there's platforms like that, because, like, if you don't jump down, you're fucked. Welcome back. Yeah, let's come back to that area. Sprint juice. Fuck you, you ass. There we go. Are you fucking kidding me? You know what? Fuck it. Hit me. Mmm. Make sweet, sweet love to me.
Fuck, 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 fuck. Fuck! The game had mercy on me. It's either that or it literally is like a three hit kill. Also, you gotta be careful because that little gap there can fucking kill you. Night shift workers at the old Coleman mine often reported hearing crying from deep inside the mine's tunnels. Again, thanks for letting me fucking... There we go. I've tried to call you dozens of times. Where are you? Please call me back and let me know you're okay. If I don't hear back in an hour, I'm coming over. I guess that's new shit. Yeah, safe and sound. North Cross Hospital. Kate, leaving this note in case you wake up tonight. I'm going to assume you don't remember what happened. I came over to check on you and found you in that park behind the house. You had a broken video camera with you and a bag full of weird drawings. I don't know what happened out there, but you're safe now. The doctors here will help you. CR. Camera's almost dead. But, we're gonna call it there. Actually, real quick, I'm gonna check. I'm missing four. Seven, four, seven, ten. Oh boy. But we're getting through the whole game, don't worry. It's not a long game. It can be annoying though sometimes. And it can be pretty spooky. But let's get rid of that uh, start screen. There we go. Shit, shit. Did I turn on the auto? Okay, thank god I did. But yeah, that's gonna do it for this stream. Be sure to follow me here on Twitch. And hit that notification bell. Bowl? What the fuck? Hit that notification bell to get notified whenever I stream. I'm trying to do more for um, the spooky season. We can get through this Resident Evil and maybe finally Devil May Cry 3. Um, be sure to follow me on. Twitter, I refuse to call it what Elon Musk wants you to call it. I am very social interactive there. It's one of the easiest ways to get a hold of me, and I do occasionally post art there, so keep an eye out for that. Also, be sure to comment, like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell on YouTube, so that way if you do miss a stream, if I remember to, you can catch the re-upload of it. 
Also, donations are not mandatory, but they are appreciated. They will go right back into the stream so I can continue to do what I do. And, uh... Oh, yeah. One more thing. It don't matter where you come from. It don't matter who you are, the color of your skin, the gender that you're born with, the gender that you choose to identify as. All walks of life does not matter. On the Salty Combat stream, we support everybody. Alright? But yeah, this is Salty Combat, saying stay metal, and as always, game until your fucking thumbs bleed. See ya.